Sure. It, uh, good to be able to get a win. Um, you know, made it interesting. I thought, uh, uh, you know, I thought we played pretty well for most of the game. And, you know, give credit to Ferris. I thought they were opportunistic. And, you know, they had some really good scoring chances. Uh, a couple there to be able to tie the game. And, you know, we were able to find a way to get the win. So it wasn't always pretty, but <laughs> it's nice to come out of here with one. And, um, you know, just a great, great opportunity for our guys. It was an awesome experience to be able to play in the tournament. Yeah, we loved it. We had guys that actually came came to the game, um, you know, last night as well, and I'm sure a bunch of us will be at the game tonight. So, uh, just you know, first class all the way, treated very well. Obviously, great competition. Um, you know, disappointed we're not playing tonight's game, but obviously, it's uh, a lot of good teams. Not everyone can make it, and it's just great experience. We'd we'd love to come back anytime. Yeah, it was nice. I mean, they, it's tough for them. I mean, going to the 7 o'clock and then turning around in that afternoon, that's a tough turnaround for them. Um, you know, we had a little bit more time that normal 24 hours, so it's a little bit different. We were just actually chatting a little bit about it, just, you know, meal times and video, trying to prep, you know, just get everything in. And it's a little bit of a hurried schedule, but, um, you know, ultimately puck drops and got to be ready to play. Yeah, I mean, I, I like our group. I, I think we, you know, we've been playing good hockey. You know, it's uh, sometimes a little bit of a struggle for us to score, but you know, I, I think I, I think we can play with anybody in the country. I think we've proven that over the last few years, and um, you know, we just continue to continue to work hard, continue to play hard, and you know, just take it one at a time and see see what comes of it at the end of the year. You know, I don't know if you're getting nervous. You're just kind of into the game, right? So you're trying to, you know, look at different adjustments and things like that, special teams and whatnot. But yeah, I mean, obviously, you want it, we we just couldn't find that next goal, right? I just felt like if we got that two goal lead, um, you know, during during that course of the game, I think you know we'd have an opportunity to be able to kind of you know keep keep building off of that. And we just never did, right? And then give them credit, right? They found that power play goal and make it two two. They had some good chances, and um, you know, lucky for us, we were able to get a bounce and you know make it three to two. I, I think it's, you know, I think it does play into it a little bit, probably for players. But you know, I think as a staff, we're just, you know, trying to find the next one, right? <laughs> well, it should be on me. So I mean, it's my job on the bench. So I, I'd, yeah, it's unacceptable. I mean, I two two of them. Um, yeah, I, I, it's a that's a common theme. So I I uh, got to take the onus on that one. Got to have the better bench management than that. I, I, you know, I, I honestly, I, I don't know if there's not, there's not too many, uh, really, in a game. I, I don't know if I've ever really even seen two, like, throughout the course of the game, let alone that close, like, being back-to-back. -back. So, it's about something about the game, right? You never <laughs> you get to see all sorts of different stuff to it. And I think, you know, we've probably been around enough, and it's like, I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Yeah, well, well, well yeah, we're, we're building some character, I guess. Yeah, I thought he was great. I mean, he just, you know, it, it, it was funny today because you mentioned the shot volume, but like in terms of scoring chances, you know, it probably was a lot closer. And we, he had some big grade A stops that he had to make. So I, I thought, I thought he was really good all weekend. He gave us a chance to win both nights. You know, unfortunately, we didn't get the third one from him last night. We did today, um, but I thought he did a great job returning, and um, he's just a, a fantastic person and great teammate. And just glad he's, you know, uh, playing for us now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't. You know. I think we did. I think we did my first year. That my first year when we were an independent. Um, just with the way that the scheduling went, we were on the road all the time. We had two, three week trips that year, and uh, like our first weekend of the year got canceled with COVID. We were supposed to go play the Gophers, so then it got tacked on to a three week trip. So I think we kind of kept that log at the end of the year. It's quite a bit, um, 
you know, the guys enjoy it. It's a lot of fun. And, yeah, now it's, you know, on a bus, we'll go eight hours to Grand Fork or to Minneapolis and then stay the night over there, catch a wild game, and then, you know, make the six, seven hours uh, up to Grand Fork. So a lot of travel time, a lot of team time, but it's a great experience. It's a hockey life, absolutely. Yeah, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Thanks for the hospitality too.